G'day folks, May here, living full-time aboard her 62-foot home on the British waterways. This summer, I'm on the move, exploring the South Oxford Canal to meet the Grand Union and Leicester Line. From there, who knows? This week, I moved from Claydon to Marston Dolls. I'm in a very musical mood. It's a busy day, and I have to have my wits about me. Join me for more adventures by subscribing to the channel. Happy cruising! Hello everybody, it's May. I'm back on the move today. It is a Tuesday afternoon and I just looked at the weather and it looks like today and tomorrow are relatively dry and from Thursday a storm is coming in and it looks like it's going to be a two week storm but let's hope not. I want to get down to the bottom of Napton Locks before the storm begins, that is the goal. It's quite a long way to go. I don't actually know exactly how long but in terms of cruising time it's probably about four hours without any locks and then the locks so another two and then maybe add another extra hour on there so you're looking at maybe seven hours of cruising down to the bottom of napton locks interestingly though i don't have to do any of this i'm just kind of in my head about it and i'm got a goal in mind and i want to get there that's one of the difficulties about being a achiever and a goal-driven person is that you kind of push yourself well I, I push myself to do these things when I don't actually need to do it I could just chill out and wait for the storm to pass but I feel like I'm on a mission I want to get down to the bottom of Napton Locks and then I'm I'm cruisy for quite a while uh, meeting friends after Braunston there's also the oh my god fed these guys earlier and they're back oh you're so cute Anyway, what was I saying before I got distracted by this cuteness? That all is well, everything's great, and I'm looking forward to the next leg of the journey.
bit coming up is really interesting and I, I'm curious as to why it's like this but basically it's a it's such a narrow bit that only one boat can actually fit down it and it's a good I don't know maybe half a kilometer long this little patch Okay. I just bought a new nappy pin. <laughs> And lady kindly said that I can use all my leaflets in the uh, Chandlery Offered Sea Marinery bit. Oh my god. Hi guys. It's signet time, isn't it? Should we get you some food? Be nice, mamas. Be nice, mamas. Be nice, mamas. That's it. That's it. Good. 
pretty much clean. The next leg of the journey is about three hours of continuous cruising. So I make myself a um, like chocolatey coffee type energy drink going to keep me going. It's called Rainbow Dust by Space Goods and it's actually pretty decent. It allows you to focus, tastes really nice. It's got mushrooms in it so adaptogens. Helps with releasing the cortisol that is related to stress. Um, it balances it out because it's got adaptogens in it, it's got mushrooms in it, so basically it's a kind of like calming and stress at the same time, because coffee creates stress in the body. So yeah, it's like a nice blend, allowing you more energised and focused and not like you're buzzing your tits off and feel overwhelmed afterwards. Although I have already had quite a bit of coffee today. <laughs> But hey ho, it's a special day. Better not use that one. Emptied. Ropes in position. Time to cast off. wondering if my front camera caught that but there was a little bit of a collision then um yeah definitely got to be a lot more on the ball cruising in summer massively so because it's so much busier and there are people that are on the canals that haven't got much experience doing this 
so they make errors, panic. I know like chocolate on my mouth. I got a song stuck in my head now and I'm going to give it to you. <clears throat> Pachamama, I'm coming home to the place where I Pachamama, I'm coming home to the place where I belong. I want to be free, so free, like the honey and honey bird, something bird and the bee. Oh, I don't know the verse. And I got a really big corner coming up, so I gotta focus. La la, so high, like an eagle in the sky. And when my time has come, mama, I'm gonna lay down and die. Patch your mama. Arse pillow. That's a pillow for my arse. My first guitar lesson on Thursday. Um, Going to get a teacher to hold me accountable for practicing more often and help me build confidence in writing my own music and maybe inspire me with different chord progressions that I haven't played around with before. Um, now that I've got quite a lot of evenings ahead of me where I'm on me Todd singing and playing music and just yeah just immersing myself in music is something that brings me a lot of joy and it's basically breath work which <laughs> Jesus Jesus Fenton Woo! Um, it's basically breath work so when you breathe when you sing it's such so good for you inhaling and you're exhaling through sound and you, you fully exhale all of that sound out and you breathe in and then it's yeah it's really great for building lung capacity and has many mental health benefits if you didn't already know i need a wee can i hold it for another hour or two ish i think i'm about halfway ish I'm not gonna hold on to my weight. Why be in discomfort when all it takes is just more and up for a second or two and uh, you know just stop being lazy basically. Look at this gorgeous boring. Bloody hell. If the weather was on our side this week, I would stay here for a night and carry on tomorrow morning. But unfortunately, that is not the case. I need a wee so bad. Oh, what's going on in here? After relieving my bladder, it was time to put the camera down and enjoy the scenery. Oh, and of course, do a bit more singing before mooring up a couple of hours later.
five hours of cruising today. It's been a long day. And I was cold when I got back in, real cold. So I put the fire on. So yeah, really happy with how far I've come. No locks, just constant moving. Constant chugging away. Next mission is to get down to the bottom of the flight. Uh, day after tomorrow, working tomorrow, and then yeah, I've got like a morning to make it happen. So it's gonna be a big morning. <laughs> but for now I can rest, I can work, I can relax and sleep. I'm doing some batch editing at the moment as I have a very busy summer ahead of me so I'll have to thank you all in person in a few weeks but for now thank you for supporting this channel for watching for commenting and being so lovely I'll see you next week for finally going further than I've ever been before can't wait see you then